एच सी वर्मा चैप्टर एट क्वेश्चन नंबर टेन अ ब्लॉक ऑफ मास एम इज किप्ट ओवर अनदर ब्लॉक ऑफ मास कैपिटल एम एंड द सिस्टम रेस्ट ऑन अ होरिजेंटल सर्फेस अ कॉन्स्टेंट होरिजेंटल फोर्स एफ एक्टिंग ऑन द लोअर ब्लॉक प्रोड्यूस एन एक्सलरेशन एफ बाई टू इन टू एम प्लस कैपिटल एम इन द सिस्टम द टू ब्लॉक्स ऑलवेज मूव टूगेदर ए फाइंड द कोफिशियंट ऑफ काइनेटिक फ्रिक्शन बिटवीन द बिगर ब्लॉक एंड द होरिजेंटल सर्फेस बी फाइंड द फ्रिक्शनल फोर्स एक्टिंग ऑन द स्मॉलर ब्लॉक C. Find the work done by the force of friction on the smaller block by the bigger block during a displacement d of the system. Since both the blocks always move together, they can be taken as a single system. Taking both the blocks as single system, let us draw the free body diagram of the system. Gravitational force of m plus capital M into g acts in vertically downward direction. Normal contact force, say n, is acting in vertically upward direction. Force F is being applied, and friction force of magnitude mu into n is acting in direction opposite to the applied force. Also, the system is moving direction of applied force with acceleration a, which according to question is F by two into m plus capital M. Balancing the forces in vertical direction, we get n is equal to capital M plus m into g. Also, the net force in horizontal direction must be equal to mass into acceleration. Therefore, F minus mu n is equal to capital M plus m into a. Putting the value of n and a, we get F minus mu into capital M plus m into g is equal to capital M plus m into F by two into capital M plus m, which implies F minus mu into capital M plus m into g is equal to F by two. Simplifying, we get mu is equal to F divided by two into capital M plus m into g. This is answer to part A of the question. Now let us look at the block on the top. The only force acting on it in horizontal direction is friction, and because of that friction, the block is moving towards right with acceleration a. Hence, friction force acting on it must be equal to mass into acceleration, that is, m f divided by two into capital M plus m. This is answer to part B of the question. The force applied by the lower block on the upper block in horizontal direction is friction, and because of that friction, the upper block moves by distance d in horizontal direction. Therefore, the work done by the lower block on the upper block is friction force into d. That is m f d divided by two into capital m plus m. This is answer to part C of the question. In order to request solution to any question from H C B R M A book, post the question number and chapter number in comments below. Like and share the video to help other students find us. Subscribe the channel, like our Facebook page, and follow us on Twitter for latest updates. Thank you for watching.